My name is Gordon Bowen from JTEC. Today I'm going to show you how to uh, check your cut-in pressure, cut-out pressure, and we're going to talk about your low air pressure warning buzzer and light, and we're going to talk about the PSI that your parking brake should pop out in case of emergency. All right, we're going to start the truck up. For right now, make sure you got your uh, wheels chalked, and you can keep your parking brake on for right now until later. It's uh, close up to 85 psi. At low idle, this truck should build from 85 psi to 100 psi in 45 seconds. At a high idle, it should build between 85 and 100 psi in 25 seconds. So we're gonna do the high idle whenever it gets around that spot. about right around that mark between 60 and 90, just about 85 right there. seconds so that would be within spec so that passed now once you hear about right between 120 and 130 psi you should hear this compressor cut out you should hear it hit the purge cycle Right now, you just heard it hit the purge cycle, so that would be your cutout pressure, and that's within spec because it's between 120 and 130 psi. So right now, I'm gonna hit the brakes, and I'm gonna let this down. Right around uh, 90 psi, you should hear the compressor kick back in. And that'll be your cut-in pressure. So as you can see, went a little bit past 90, but it's already starting to build pressure again. So that would be within spec. All right, now we're gonna do the uh, low air pressure warning buzzer and light, and that should be around about 60 or 65 PSI. Some trucks are different, but you should hear the buzzer come on and the warning indicator light should come on. So that's about 65, so that's within spec and that passed too. Now, about 45 PSI, you should push this parking brake in, and about 45 PSI, that parking brake should automatically pop out because in like a, a low, low pressure emergency going down the highway or something, and you're losing a lot of air pressure, this parking brake should pop out so you can stop. So we're gonna take this. Down by 45, you should see this pop out. And it has yet to pop out. So that failed. It's not within spec. I'm almost at 30 PSI and it still hasn't popped out. Yeah, so that's bad. But all right, you can set your brake again. And that's how you check your cut-in pressure, cut-out pressure, check your uh, low warning indicator light, and that's how you check your parking brake.